Just in the cave. It's a room. And that's the secret. Look at that. What up, everybody? This is your boy, DJ Mixmaster, and welcome back to Horizon Zero Dawn. Last video, we ended up taking part in the Hunter's Trials here near Norland and almost getting a perfect on all three of the trials. But with that being said, we're going to go ahead and continue on with the story. Metal flower, along with some things we couldn't pick up back when we were a child. But now that we've all grown up, we can do some exploring. So, let's see. Nothing in here. And there's that metal flower. These metal flowers, along with the other collectibles we could pick up, are things we could trade when we finally get to Meridian for some stuff. Now I don't know how good it'll be, but considering that these are, these uh, collectibles are purple rarity, probably something at least decent. Ah, let's go into this back room. Is there anything we can pick up or ah here we go. Anything else? Nope. Ah, our friend in which we picked up our focus. Ah, two from the first set. See, there it is. A metal flower, unknown design, possibly used to promote seed germination. 
probably said that wrong, but whatever. Includes an embedded code fragment. Trade sets of these flowers in Meridian for valuable rewards. And we picked up something new. Oh yeah, right, the metal flower. What? Another one of these power cells. But what do I do with it? Hmm, where did I leave behind? Oh, a health potion. I should probably start using those more than trying to do the little quick healing. I need to come at this like I do with Kingdom Hearts. Probably use the potions first and then heal with my other natural abilities or whatever. Okay, anything else I can get into? Can I go back there? Uh, it doesn't like there's anything back there for me. Uh, I remember this door sealed behind me when I went through it. What? Like Aloy, saw it. Aloy said, we're older now. There we go. Let's see, back here is where these two were, right? The one decided to take himself out with a gunshot. Yep, that's him. Looks like I can't get back there either. Anything else? Can I get back here? Uh, there's nothing back there for me, okay. There's nothing in here, I believe. Good meat. It might be useful, it might not, who knows, we'll see. If Fishbone is in here, then probably the rats will probably be useful in some capacity, maybe. Alright. And as you saw it said, hunting grounds completed. I came back also off screen to complete that blast trial and got it within, I think, 45 seconds, I think. I kind of cheated. Not like cheated like I wanted to, but cheated in that I ended up placing one of the blast wires. Let's go for you. One of the blast wires near a log pile and then when I drove the the herd towards one of my traps the blast I only caught one of them ended up blowing up the logs and I guess that all counted towards that one blast uh, wire kill and so they just chained together and I was like ah oh, it works for me Let's go pick up another mount. 
so that we don't have to be constantly walking and running everywhere. But, on our way to get our mount, we're going to replenish our health supply. And pick up some bonus stuff. Where'd that other one go? Ooh, I can't override him. The other one's like right in front of him. I gotta find somewhere to hide. Find somewhere to hide. If I can find anywhere to hide. At least I think the other one was like in front of him. I can't really tell. I think they're both right there. Well, I think we're close, so let's see where, how far are we? Yeah. Another wounded person? Is that a corpse at his feet? Never mind. Just sitting around corpses, huh? Okay. He didn't kill him, did he? Or maybe he did. Well, let's talk to this uh, stranger. There's danger ahead, girl. Danger for you, Outlander. This is Noraland. Yes, yes, yes. Trespass is forbidden on pain of death. Strange phrase, the pain of death. See? This one's in no pain at all. Who was he? A thief, a slaver, a killer. The kind that give honest killers a bad name. Frawl told me there would be bandit ambushes on the road. Well, it's not all good news. They don't always come to you. Most dig out a camp, and there they'll sit like spoil on meat. Unless someone does something about it? I like you. Follow the trail of smoke on the other side of the ruins. I'll be there. Okay, crazy person. Meanwhile, let's see where we can go. Some, my focus is picking up some kind of signal. Maybe I can scan it. Uh, can we grab that? It looks like a like a little foothold thing, but can't reach it. Whip. There was a metal flower down here, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, there it is right there. I'll shake it out later. And 
that's the secret. Look at that. Woo! I haven't seen one of these since I was a little kid. I think the old ones use numbers like this to indicate time. These devices are missing power cells. I'll have to find power cells to get these to work. And boom. So we already have two, so. There, fits. I just need to slot in one more. That's two. It's some kind of code. Maybe there's a clue nearby. Okay, so 12, 15, 18, 21, 0. So 12, that's straight up, okay. 15, which is three, so we need to turn clockwise. Maybe there's some more information nearby. Something that will tell Wait. me how this works. Looks like Wrong each dial way. has more positions. Um, maybe if I get each dial in the right position. Let's see, what was it, 12, 15, 18, which is six. Twenty-one, which is nine. have the armor locked in place. Maybe there's a way to power up the mechanism, release the clamps. Ah. Uh, oh, hell, potion. That's fine. We can leave that. What are you? There we go. Ultra Wii progress. Collectible. Tutorial and Bandit Camp. A new ammo type. The Tear Blast Arrow. So that's what that purple was. Deals no damage but very high tear. Shortly after impact. A powerful compressed air blast. Useful for stripping armor and components. Ooh, I think I'm going to love this arrow. Another the trials. to install these power cells. That should do it. Alright. We only have two, so we only have the two, so we use that for the first part. Yeah, come on. There we go. But this armor is the shield weaver armor. It's not from the age of the old ones. But how do I get to it? It's not all of this metal plating, it's really just going to be these little doohickeys you see in the glowing parts. Apparently they're going to get stitched onto Aloy's armor, which is, or, uh, yeah, essentially. Which is going to be kind of the base outfit, what we have on now, plus the, those little itty bitty parts. Oh, I can't say okay. All right, health potion. Like I said, we can leave that alone. 
the shield weaver armor and I think I mentioned this maybe in the first couple of videos that I think Horizon kind of plays like uh, Assassin's Creed 2 but Assassin's Creed 2 there's these things called uh, Assassin's Tombs or maybe they're called Vaults, Assassin's Vaults, I can't remember but at the main base for Ezio this house underneath it is this statue of I think what is it Altair in which has this master of Asa masters Asa uh, assassin's armor like a fish <laughs> in which has like the best stats and everything but in order to unlock it you have to uh get these seals i think it's like five six seals to place in slots around this armor and the vaults are spread out through that world some you know some here some there so basically you can't really get this armor until close to end game with that shield weaver armor it follows the same suit you won't be able to get uh, da, 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 drafts of potions okay uh, what quest are we on right now we were gonna do this one First, let's go pick this up, and then we'll go to the tall neck. But uh, yeah, it follows the same formula. Let's see if we can get a mount. Actually, it better. Sure. My focus is picking up some kind of signal. Maybe I can scan it. Oh, you turned around. Oh, I ran. Right. I totally forgot about that. Uh, you don't see me. You don't see me. I just need to get behind you somehow. That's pretty decent ears, huh? <laughs> but yeah, we won't be able to pick up the Shield Weaver armor because the other three power cells are in other ruins in this world. But we can't just go to where the ruins are and just pick up the power cell. We have to do it when we get the particular mission to go to the particular ruin. But the Shield Weaver armor is special in that it's an armor that has like a force field, force field around it that blocks damage. So back to what I was saying. So the Shield Weaver will recharge. So there's a... Uh, four difficulty modes for Horizon. You have Easy, you have Normal, which is what we're playing on, you have Hard, and you have Extra Hard. And it's like, apparently, well, not apparently, but it was 500. Uh, let's uh, see where this tall neck. I tried to pick up resource. Come back. I'm gonna leave you for now. And look at that sucker. Uh, wrong button. 
tall neck. Body, climb holds, and the radar, which is on top of its head. Now, this is the only machine we cannot kill. But we have to climb onto it about on its back around that. So, we have to find some footing that will allow us to get up there. So, it looks like something from up here. Turn this way. Just a bit. I suck so badly. There we go. Okay, where are you? There you are. Alright, now we're in the clear. This should be a good spot for jumping onto the tonic. Alright, so now all we gotta do is wait. Okay, so back to the shield wheel. So, apparently through all four difficulty modes, uh, the health for the shield weaver was 500. And so, with of course game developers and multiple games being able to track data and whatnot, woo! There we go. Made it. Now to climb up to his head. I think Gorilla saw that people were able to cheese the end game. Which of course it's in game, so it should be hard with the shield weaver and just. Alright, let's override you. So that was a very large EMP, something I read about when you override a tall neck, you could wait to repel down until you're close to enemies, and then once you repel down, boom, they get shocked and it allows you to either to quick kill them or to escape. I thought that was just some kind of cool effect, but nope. Critical hit plus. Combat, right. Herbalist. Uh, let's go with 